All right, how's everybody doing today? Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Today we are reviewing the Tempano TPT base 3000 watt Brazilian amplifier. Uh, it is class D amplifier. It is made in Brazil, as you can see, and it is by Temp Tempano. Now this company is uh, they sent me a bunch of stuff, so they sent me their amplifier and a box and a sub. And I'm gonna go through four videos, so this this will probably be my my second or third video in the playlist, but it will be all laid out in a playlist for you to watch. So let's get into it. So the stats on this on this amplifier are: it is 3,000 watts RMS at one ohm, 1,800 watts RMS at two ohms. Now we do have a low pass filter, uh, 30 hertz to 250 hertz, a subsonic filter at 8 hertz to 40 hertz, bass boost frequency to uh, 30 hertz to 70 hertz, and boost is 0 dB to 10 dB. Alright, let's see. So input impedance is 5k ohms, supply voltage 9 volts to 17 volts DC which is pretty good um musical consumption is 132 amps bass consumption is 265 amps and the dimensions are three inches by nine nine point three inches by nine inches and the weight is six pounds now it does not weigh it doesn't feel like it weighs six pounds it's actually pretty light uh but it is but it is way it does weigh six pounds maybe because i'm just strong but yeah, so let's just get this thing open and see what they sent us. All right, guys, taking it out of the box here, it comes with a sticker. You just peel this off and put it inside your car. Uh, it's a Tipano uh, sticker, and it also comes with a um, user manual for the base 3K, and they also have a base 5K. Uh, and going through the manual, it, it just shows both base 3k and base 5k on this page or one of these pages and it also goes over the specs that i just um, laid out so looking at the actual amplifier it has a protect uh power protect and clip kind of the same as the tar amp but i do gotta admit this one does look a lot beefier than the tar amp and i'm a lot more excited uh to, um in this one than in the tar amp and the reason why is because look at this they actually have zero gauge inputs the tar amp does not have zero gauge inputs and it has two uh two power fans in, built inside actually no four power fans which will help the cooling actually no it is too this is just the exhaust for the the fan so two fans has two in the two exhausts for the for the air um and let's see if the let's see the input for right here now this looks like i think that looks like that looks like four gauge speaker inputs so you can use four gauge wire right here okay and then looking at this so we have the gain right here subsonic filter low pass filter bass boost and frequency for the bass boost and then this one i think this one just turns on the emblem if i'm not mistaken but i'm just going to keep that off for now uh, we have the RCAs right here, only one input, which is nice, so you don't get confused. Uh, we also have four, four screws that you can like screw down on each side, and yeah, dude, this this thing looks really nice. Um, I don't know if you, it, it's super shiny, and you can literally see the reflection. Guys, in terms of build quality, this amplifier is amazing dude like i think i may just replace what i'm what i have rocking right now which is a tar amp base 3k and replace it with this tim timpano um base 3k um yeah i want to see the difference between them uh if y'all want to see a video on the difference between them then let me know down below um i don't have a uh i don't have an amp dyno so i can't really test out the how much how much watts this actually produce but i you just gotta trust the rating and from what i see uh brazilian styles amps are very accurate um in their rating and they're very compact and good 
uh, this is this is another one that is amazing and I will show you it in the car soon stay tuned all right all right guys time to replace the torrent base 3k with the tempano base 3k uh let's get it done all right guys got it all hooked up let's get a demo of my regular setup and yeah i can already tell setting the i just set the gains this thing moves these subs let me tell you it's time to test out the 3k tempano uh one ohm amp uh, on my actual on my main setup the American base setup and then in the next video I will be doing the 3k tempo, uh, tempano amp on the actual tempano sub that I got so first song we're gonna play is Ric Flair drip let's do it As you can see, this amp really hits hard. I'm actually gonna be replacing my um, tar amp with this amp because in my opinion, it does, it, it really does hit harder than the tar amp. Um, if you don't believe me, try out this amp for yourself and you can actually see how much power this thing can run. All right guys, that'll be the end for this video. In the next video, I will be testing the Timpano um, 12 inch sub on the Tempano Base 3K. And stay tuned for that because I already have, I've already tried it out a little bit and it hits hard. All right guys, see you in the next one. Peace.